Hi guys. Let me see. I'm going to. Yep, right there. Okay. <laughs> I'm back again. Oh my goodness. <laughs> so I'm excited to film. I have a pile of things ready to be filmed. So I'm I'm just like, oh, I gotta get this stuff done. So it just seems well. I have car class this week, and um, I had to I had to design all my cards. So I'm like, uh, hello, who's gonna do it for you? Know who's gonna do it? You have to do it, and I was gonna do it for you. So <laughs> it was one of those like, okay, get your butt together and get this stuff done. So I've been focusing on cards, and so this is taking a back burner, and I'm like, darn it, you know? Oh, <laughs> I hate when that happens. So. Okay, so this is week, what week is this? Week 30. This is week 30, and this is the week that we went to the Faith Hill Tim McGrath concert that Cheyenne um, and Cordell got me for Mother's Day. So it was such a great show. It really was. They put on a really good show, and uh, we had decent seats. And so we were like, um, there's floor... And then there's one more, and we were the second. So there's, we weren't the upper, upper level. So nosebleeds, we were one below nosebleeds. So that, yeah, so that was cool. And um, we were like center, like totally center on them. So that was, that was great. And then, um, so uh, their show was, I mean, I've, I've never seen a Faith Hill in concert, you know, back in the day. I've always, um, I've got, this is my third Soul, soul to Soul uh, concert and uh, with them, and um, that's how I've, I've seen them. Well, um, the last time they performed, they did, it, um, they did it together. So they did most of the songs together. Well, this time, she sang a buttload of her, of her uh, hits, and then he sang too, and it was like by themselves. So they did by themselves, and then they did together, and that made it such a spectacular concert. And it was like two and a half hours that they sang straight; they didn't stop. So you know, you, intermission or anything like that, because I was like, intermission, I want some popcorn, you know, or you know, nachos or something, right? I wanted to splurge. Never mind, we went to the Cheesecake Factory just to. <laughs> an hour before then never mind that <laughs> so um endless pit of a belly right and uh so uh, so we um but no no intermission no no nothing like that so and you know who else has a great concert um pink P if you can go to a pink concert she is amazing she is so high energy and so much fun Oh, those tickets are so worth it. So I know she's going to be touring again. And I told Cheyenne, I am buying those tickets because I missed out on her last concert. We've only seen her once. And I regret not, not seeing her the second time because, hello, she's amazing. And, um, well, so, where's my little pictures? <laughs> so, wait, I'm missing something here. <laughs> so, uh, this collection is by American Crafts. And it is called Sunny. So this is from American Crafts. Yeah. So, um, and uh, I just wanted bright colors, you know, because it was such a, it was, it was such a lousy uh, night, you know, a way to end our night. So, um, so that, so I wanted something bright and you know, cheery instead of dismal, you know. So and blah. So, yeah. But anyways, so. What is wrong with this? Oh, it's empty. <laughs> it's empty. <laughs> Can't keep trying to get something out of it. So, um, but yeah, so I would, um, so when Pink goes on con in concert again, uh, we're going to go. And you know who puts on a lousy concert? Rihanna. Yeah. Talk about this chick thinks that her, you know, music is that great that she can leave people waiting for two hours. And then, uh, and then she, her, um, her, her opening act, I guess is what they call it, was um, a rapper dude. Well, this rapper dude says, okay, come on, you know, tells these chicks, you know, from the audience, hey, who wants to come up, you know, and they freaking give him a lap dance, and I'm like, oh my god, if this was my kid, I would be, oh, 
I would storm that stage and like beat the heck out of her. So I'm like, some of these chicks are just, wow. <laughs> so talk about like feeling really old when I went to that concert. Cause I'm like, oh my God. And it was me and Cheyenne and I bought her tickets to go see Rihanna and, uh, Oh, never again will I go see that chick. Never again. So, yeah, two hours waiting for her to get her butt out there. And then she didn't even sing the full the full time. She only sang, like, for an hour. So that was... And then the audio was so off. It was just awful. So, yeah, so that is, like, the worst concert ever. And my brother, his, his um, ex-girlfriend used to work for the... Um, I think it's, I think they always change the name. It's SAP Center, but it was HP Pavilion. So I don't know. I don't know what name it is this week, but that's our, where the Shark Tank is at, uh, the hockey team. That's our local hockey team. And, uh, well, um, they got, she worked there. She worked there as a, as a usher. And so she, um, she got, um, this was in Cheyenne was, you know, younger, like teenager. And, uh, she saw, oh, well, here's some uh, tickets, free tickets, if you want to see Ricky Martin. And we were like, yeah, okay, you know, free tickets, let's go. And so we went, and it was such a high-energy show, and it was so fun. And then you see these guys dancing in the aisles, and they were getting down with the pole, and I'm like, oh, my Lord. <laughs> So it was just, it was hilarious to watch this show. So yeah, so there's been some great concerts that we have been to, and there's been not so great concerts that we have been to. So, but uh, Faith Hill and Tim McGraw were like spot on. Really, really good. So, so happy with that one, which was great. So, so we took lots of photos. I was kind of bummed that this was in the way, you know, that the, that that was in the way because I'm like oh bummer but you know it is what it is so it's not a big deal but um and you can still see her face so I'm okay I was okay with that because I mean I've been following them since uh it's your love um that's when I discovered them was that was that one so um that song so I this is this is that era this is when they were 20 years ago so that's uh so i went, really wanted to put those pictures in here because i remember that and you know they kind of remind me of like tim and uh and myself were you know we're very close and we like being together i mean i don't know them personally but i mean would you really go with your spouse on tour if you didn't really like being with them so um so i would assume <laughs> so but um yeah so it was uh it was fun but i really like this adhesive you guys and it sticks to the pockets you know because remember i tell you glossy accent sucks for sticking on your pockets don't put your embellishments on your outside pockets with glossy accents because it will not stay so it will not so it just pops right off <laughs> well this I've already tried and it's awesome so the pebbles <laughs> I can't remember who the um it was Chamel uh, yeah I believe it's Chamel well she had the um hat and then she had the coffee cup which was perfect because Cheyenne wears her hats and then this is a record and I thought oh my god that is so like perfect so I was like taking a picture <laughs> so I put it on the picture and I'm like yeah that worked whoops so, and it dries very fast, you guys. This adhesive dries very, very fast. So, and then Cheyenne, my beautiful baby. So, that's her next to me. So, and I added this one too. Oh my gosh, you guys. Totally out. Well, it's okay. We'll just use this glue. I just went to Tuesday morning. I didn't see any of that adhesive. Hmm. Oh well. Not supposed to have any more, I guess, right? So, are, isn't the colors already like coming along? They're just so fun. And then this was a girl that was next to her, and I'm like, oh, okay, we'll cover her up. You know how I like covering up people because they're not the focus of my picture. So you got to get out, get out. <laughs> so I don't know who you are. So please get out. And um, okay, so here is my maybe once a year. Once a year, I'll take a picture, but it has to be like, ugh. So I did it. I took a picture and I put it in my PL, you guys. I did it. I put it in my PL. 
so it's here and this is my token picture and this is once a year so yeah and um but yeah i couldn't i couldn't not take a picture of my baby so so here you go so here i am looking at the camera here i am like trying to smile and i'm like oh my god <laughs> this is so weird <laughs> so <laughs> so but that is me i got like chipmunk cheeks so i gotta get rid of those things darn it you know totally got to get rid of those so and i'm working on it little by little day by day we take it just one day at a time so how are you guys you guys all good so paula m i have food in this picture in this picture in this uh pl so here's my food <laughs> i'll tell you about that one I usually don't like, you know what, let me just do that off camera because you know I don't like doing, peeling this stuff off when it comes to sentiments on camera because it takes me forever because I have no nails. So, because I have no nails, it takes forever. So I'd rather not do that and waste your time with that. So. so, here we go. I did a lot of glitter on this one because I'm like, you know, glitter is cool. So it's a selfie on this day. See? So, there we go. There's me. <laughs> and so this is my food picture. So Tim, he says, he says, um, honey, he goes, I really, he, and he, we're not, we're not ice cream eaters. We're, we're not. So, um, but he says, he, he says, hon, he says, I'm really craving a banana split. And I said, okay, hon, I'm like, no problem. We'll, we'll get the ingredients and we'll, I'll make you some. So he's like, okay. And so we have these massive bowls. And so we, uh, and then we had um, some Rocky Road ice cream already. And then um, some strawberry. And, um, and then so we just bought some vanilla. And then I bought pecan chips because those were cheaper than the walnuts and, um, or the regular peanuts. And uh, oh my God, those pecan chips, you guys. Woo, those were scrumptious. So yeah, so I made him a major banana split and had all caramel and <laughs> had the whole shebang and he was ecstatic. So that, that like hit his craving. <laughs> so I was all I'll hook you up, honey. Don't worry. <laughs> I'll take care of you. I got you. <laughs> so, and both my boys were like, yeah. <laughs> so it was cool. But I had to take a picture because it looks so scrumptious, you know, it looks really scrumptious. So and this is the week i got my brother scan and cut too and i got it on hsn because it's on easy pay and easy pay i can do <laughs> easy pay is my friend so um so i got it and i got it on on this week 30 and yeah i still have not turned it on i haven't even turned it on that's how much time i don't have you guys there's just not enough time in the day and it's kind of intimidating so i have been you know stalling <laughs> so uh so yeah so i will eventually turn it on i know that i know that i will <laughs> eventually but um yeah so oh my goodness it's hot in here with these lights on <laughs> i am sweating oh my goodness so this was bus upside down like he likes to be and cat on the bed because they sleep on our bed and this was cat <laughs> laying on his like leg and just in between his legs on the pillow and he's upside down and he's just oh uh, they're just both hilarious they're both cuties so <laughs> i took a picture of them of course so and i got to use my freckled fawn yummy rubber uh, embellishments did you guys see how they have a sell I'm like oh my goodness so you guys can buy the pass kits and stuff I think it's over with though but um, yeah you could buy the pass kits I think that's too low oh that's too low that's what I get for not paying attention too much so pick these up real quick so pay attention so, and then we will just lift it. See? Lift, lift, lift. That's all it takes. 
So I'm going to put these back. Yeah, all of this from Freckle Fawn. Yeah, they had a major, like, I think they said 80% off or something. I'm not sure. So, something like that. I'm excited be, to do week 31 because, yeah, because Cheyenne and I were together again, I think. Yeah, I think that's 31. Pretty sure. I printed them out. <laughs> yeah, I'm pretty sure that is. So I'm looking forward to, that, to doing that one too because she's in all my pictures. So it's been pretty cool. And you know, you guys, how I told you she has PCOS and Erica. Um, yeah, it's a, it's a really cruddy disease for a woman. It really is. And so, uh, well, she has been doing research and research and research. And they told her that, um, well, I mean, they told her, she read that um, if she goes gluten-free and vegan, that should help reverse her symptoms. And so um, she is, so she is vegan and gluten-free and she, she's, she's been doing it for two weeks now and she's doing very good, but you know, it's hard to find food. And of course, you know, you can pay six dollars for a salad and a dollar for a hamburger and so it sucks you know it does suck they preach and preach that you know we should ha eat better and all that stuff but they don't make it affordable they like to say that it's affordable but it's not it really isn't like i said that one time i went to whole foods and got a um a box of salad and it was 14 or no 18 14 or 18 dollars something like that and i'm like <laughs> you know a, a freaking 12 piece fried chicken <laughs> bucket would have been $8.99. I'm like, dudes, hello. So yeah, so it's really, it's a really cruddy, a cruddy thing. But she's been doing good and she had to go to the doctor though because she's not um, feeling very well. Um, her her um, cycle has is happening now and um, so she's just going through that. So you guys it, who have PCOS, it, you know, it's a, it's a tough road. It really is. But you can do it. You totally can do it. And there are so many Facebook groups that, that offer support. So, you know, seriously, just look up, um, look up PCOS and then vegan. So read, read and research. So this is the summer babies. There's the little, my little, my turkey, my girl turkey. She had seven babies and well, those, now she has two. So I like to think that the other five, um, said, I want to have rebellion and they left so I will think positive instead of not positive right so yeah so they went and ventured on their own so she has two that are that are mama's mama's babies so they stayed so um, yeah and so I took a picture of them and I need my arrow I forgot my arrow I don't know I didn't I didn't find one I forgot so in this one I decided to use the bigger these bigger um, sentiments because I'm like, you know what? That works because awesome showtime. You know, it was it was a great time with Cheyenne. You know, we went out to dinner and we got cheesecake. Hello, my favorite of all time. So, the the if you ever visit New York, you know who has the best cheesecake ever. Is Junior's cheesecake I mean seriously they have the ultimate cheesecake so yeah if you ever see a sale on them and they're always on QVC buy one and see for yourself because it is amazing it's so smooth so creamy and when we went to New York on vacation we had one a day we went there every day it was great okay so isn't this fun it's fun right all the colors match I, I just, you know, it made me happy. And considering the night that I had that night, it was this, this made me happy and this made me smile and smile. <laughs> My lips didn't want to separate on that one. <laughs> so anyways, let me say thank you to Peggy Rochelle and Paula M for leaving me comments. Um, love you guys. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. And uh, I hope you love the layout like I do. Fanny hands, fanny hands very short video. We'll see you guys. I'll be back. Bye.